during my days at the undergrad level all my friends who got the city campus actually went there and they did not regret it because at the end of the day on your certificate it's not going to be stated on it that you were at the city campus the Kolebu campus or the main campus the fact is you came to the university of ghana so do not really worry at all welcome back to my channel i hope you're doing very well i'm fine thank you also so after i uploaded my last video on my q a for this year's admission at the university of ghana i asked that i was going to do a part two so all of you who still have questions unanswered should ask me in the comment section of that video and i've gotten a couple of questions so i just want to do a sit down video answering some of the questions i got from the comment section of my previous video and i've gotten just a few of them here in my youtube studio my whatsapp and in my email so i'm starting from my youtube studio app here and this one just came in like 21 hours ago it's from next level next level is saying that um please when are you going to tour upsa and its hostels i love your videos by the way thank you so much for watching my videos always so yes i was busy um the past couple of weeks and um yes so i will do it now that i'm a bit free i will make sure i bring that video to you as soon as possible upsa regents university or something um wisconsin and all the neighboring universities around university of ghana so do not worry at all be on the lookout keep your fingers crossed it is coming yes okay this is from laurisha afri laurisha is asking thank you for your directions for we the freshers thank you so much for watching the videos i hope they are helping you in one way or the other when you see me on campus do not forget to holler me i'll be so happy to meet all of you on campus yes um can you change from city campus to main campus this is coming from b1 tones tv most of the question i got from most of you coming to the university of ghana this year is that you've been given the city campus although you selected the main campus as your preference um I believe that anything is possible though it's not easy so our advice you come to campus the main campus go to the registry speak to the admissions team and I'm sure something can be done for you with regard to why you think you deserve to be in the main campus and just give them your reasonable challenges as to why you still think that being in the main campus is best for you I think anything is possible just give it a shot I know it's not easy but it is possible. So all of you who have been given the city campus instead of the main campus, this is my answer to you. I, during my days at the undergrad level, all my friends who got the city campus actually went there and they did not regret it. Life you know, changes is their school fees, but they did not really regret it because at the end of the day, on your certificate, it's not going to be stated on it that you were at the city campus, the Kolebu campus, or the main campus. The fact is, you came to the University of Ghana, so do not really worry at all. If you can, just go there, apply, get a hall or a hostel for yourself, and you're good to go, okay? There's a lot going on now, and I'm not sure you want to go through all the stress, changing your campus or your program and all of that good stuff. Anyway, I wish you all the very best, guys. That is from Boaz Gezi. Boaz is asking, does a Kwafu Hall have a grocery shop and does it also have a boutique? Yes, a Kwafu Hall has a grocery shop. Mind you, most of the halls on campus, be it traditional or um, the main halls, has even more than one grocery shop. All the halls on campus, if I'm not lying, have a grocery shop. So do not really worry at all about where to buy your provisions or your day-to-day -day, you know, items from. And some of the halls also, like Liman like this, it has a convenience shop behind the hall. So there's a place you can buy your clothes, shave your face, shave your hair as a lady. There's a, um, a barbering shop, a hair saloon, a boutique. Some of the halls have more than you might think. Yeah, so do not worry at all about where to get provisions or any of those good stuff. Even if you don't get them from your house, trust me, you'll get them from either the night market or the supermarket or even the bush canteen. So do not worry at all about grocery shops or boutique on campus. Don't worry at all. Um, Amofa Benjamin is asking, how can an individual get admitted at the city campus? Why? Okay, whilst his or her budget is made for main campus, 
um don't worry as i have previously answered this question just do due diligence and get to the admission team at the registry just talk to them about your plights as to why you think you don't you cannot be at the city campus at this point in time because of your financial challenges and i'm sure of course they are very reasonable people they should be able to listen to you and help you with your problem yes um this is from rebecca somewhere please i want the main campus oh my goodness i got this question a lot don't worry as i've answered follow what i have said and let's see if something positive can come out of it um nimatu sakibu is asking which year are you in now at this point i think i'm in level if i'm not lying 600 or 700 i'm doing my phd yeah so just count it calculate it yeah my master's was just a year 15 months i should say and then yeah phd i'm starting phd this year so i, I think I, sh I should be in level 600 or 700 i do not really know <laughs> but i'm not your level <laughs> no offense though nima to sakibu is also say wow interesting helpful thank you nancy okay thank you so much i'm happy my videos are helping you in one way or the other yes don't forget to share the videos to anyone you know will be coming to the university of ghana this year or in the later year for them to also benefit from it mensa is asking as an art student i had an art grade of eight can i offer bsc nursing in your ug eugene is not mine first of all and you don't offer a program the school offers you a program for you to come and pursue it so um of course that grade eight is a good grade trust me i already have a video about the nursing school and all the requirement it takes to be in that school so please I think it's part of the two videos I last posted, so please go check through my videos and look for the nursing video. Um, I got the administrator in the nursing school to explain in detail what it takes to be at the school of nursing. So please take your time and watch that video to the very end and I'm sure your question will be answered for you. But I think I grade 8 is quite a good grade to be in the nursing school. Don't worry, don't send me your grades, I don't really need it for nothing. Um, social science b2 english b3 no i don't need it <laughs> i don't need it honestly just tell me what you got and i can um help you out with the cutoff point but trust me also guys do well to visit the university of ghana website i will always refer you to the website because all the information that you require is found on the university of ghana website they have outlined all the cutoff points over there so please do due diligence and visit the website and learn all about the university of ghana over there don't try to give me work to do when you can just do it on your own okay i can't kind of spoon feed all of you yeah smith alia i learned sometimes that frosters do give fake admissions and so if you are given a fake admission how will you know this is my first time hearing this and um of course it's possible but this is the first time i'm hearing this I, for one, when I got admission at the University of Ghana, both undergrad, master's, and even PhD, I was sent a test message by the university, so I know it's authentic because it's coming from them. I also received my admission details in my email and on my University of Ghana application portal. So if you check all these three sites or places and you are still not convinced, then I am sorry, your admission might be fake. Do not expect someone to hand you over your admission letter uh, in person university of ghana doesn't work like that they will always send it to your admission portal they'll write congratulations very beautifully when you've been given admissions yeah and i also was tested let me look for my message from the university for you to serve as a proof when you first apply and everything goes through successfully they will send you a test message to say that okay so so and so we received your ad application and all of that um so this is mine I don't know if you can see it it's from ug up here so it says dear nancy you've started your application blah 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 your pin is this your s no serial number is this and show you complete so at every point in time they will send you a test message so um i don't know what you're talking about it's possible there are frosters in the system you have to be on the lookout and trust me it's always good to apply to the university yourself so you can follow through the processes yourself. If you allow someone to apply on your behalf, um, I'm sorry, but it's not the best. 
you can help you can get someone to help you or assist you with the application process an elderly person or someone who has even been through the system to guide you with the applications um, you know process but not necessarily pay money to someone else to i mean this whole thing is just you just have to be wise and open your eyes so that people don't really dupe you like that i hope i've answered your question smith um this world he said i think you shouldn't mention the names to make things clear and faster oh okay some people too when i mention their name then they know their questions have been answered anyway thank you for that um suggestion roots tabiri says i'm a certificate nurse and i want to know if i can do my top up in legon as in doing a degree course i think so i asked this question in the nursing school video and i think the administrator was kind enough to answer that question for me so please if you have not watched that video go watch it and get your question answered for you yeah it's university of ghana having wi-fi yes the student wi-fi works everywhere at least for me it works everywhere on campus for me at the lecture hall on campus walking to the grocery shop walking to bush canteen anywhere on campus i'm fully connected to the university of ghana wi-fi yes so there's wi-fi on campus don't worry at all <laughs> yeah i think i'll end the questions here i'm so happy for all of you coming to the university of ghana this year i am so happy for you and so proud you've made it this far it's not easy most of your colleagues in secondary school also wish to be in the university of ghana but for one reason or the other not all of them are here so you've made it this far and i'm so proud of you please make good use of your time here try as much as possible to Try as much as possible to go down this channel and search for some of the videos I have done previously on what you can do to maximize your time here at the University of Ghana. Do internships, you know, volunteer. Do things to enhance your development as a person. Don't just come here through the four years and just do academic work and go. No, there's so much more to being a student than just going for lectures and getting good grades and passing your exam. No. The Counseling and Placement Center is there for you to assist you with all your problems, um, be it internship, be it psychological problems, emotional, whatever it is. Do well to visit the Counseling and Placement Center and I'm sure they will be of a very good help to you and make your stay here at the University of Ghana a successful one. Yes, so let me see you on campus, please. Okay. I'll be at the Institute of African Studies. You can just pass by or send me a DM on Instagram so that I can give you my telephone number and we can meet and talk, okay? So we meet same time next time. Stay safe and may God bless you. Be kind to someone today, okay? I love you all and have a peaceful stay here at the University of Ghana. <laughs>